This event is really cool because you can rock up um, without having to own your own boat. So for us or the age about 23, it's really cool for us to be able to sail with, sail with our friends and race in the actuals. I think it's great for all of us to be able to sail together and so openly, whereas if we were in a big fleet, I mean, I'd never get the opportunity to drive the boat unless I actually owned one. So in that sense, if you know what the driver's feeling and you know how difficult these boats actually are to steer, it's a much easier to be a, a better main trimmer and a better tactician if you actually know all the roles involved. We're quite new to the actual class this year and we're just really keen to get as much racing experience as we can at this point. We're trying to work together as a team, we've got a few new members, trying to get them into it as well. I'm learning so much from the actuals because the boats are so technical and uh, require so much thought and you can basically change everything on the boat, whereas lots of boats, everything's one design, but this is that you can change the mast rate, you can change literally everything you can imagine. So it really teaches you a lot about how boats work and how to make them go fast and how to not make them go fast, so it's really good. We were chosen to come over and sail the Gertrude Cup and it's a wonderful event because it's not only puts a bunch of youth teams and senior teams at an equal level, but it provides an opportunity for youth and younger people to sail a boat that's dominated by people that are usually a lot older than us. And I think it's introducing a lot of younger blood to the class and it's bringing us not only to here to England, but it's bringing Australian and English teams to the US and bringing us all over. And I think it's a wonderful opportunity for us and a wonderful opportunity for youth teams around the world to come compete on an equal level in an amazing place.